Everybody's got their thing. Some people are the pretty person, the athletic person, the tall person, fat person. Everyone's got their thing. And lately I've been doing a little soul searching, trying to figure out what is my thing. For the longest time I was like, oh, obviously I'm the funny guy, right? But then I look back at a couple of my uh, older YouTube videos and I'm realizing I might not actually be the funny guy. One thing that popped in my head is, hey, maybe I'm the handsome guy, you know? But then when I was at my big money engineering corporate job the other day, I had a bit of a brain blast. I was uh, helping one of my coworkers. I gave her a solution to the problem she had and she said, wow, Xavier, you're so smart. And there it was, I'm the smart guy. Now, of course, being the smart guy, I'm into science and all that stuff. So I never really claim to be anything without a little bit of proof. So today I'm gonna take an IQ test to prove that I am in fact the smart guy. Uh, so here's a random one I found online. Seems like most of them are behind paywalls. So hopefully this one actually is free. You can see Einstein's on it. That guy had like one of the highest IQs ever. And me and Einstein have basically the same hair. So pretty pumped to take this one. Be ready to determine whether the statement... Let's get started. This sequence, this, this sequence of big elephants can always understand small elephants. Okay, apparently I'm a fucking genius. <gasps> written the number 1,125 would be written 5,000. Wait, what? Uh, Gary has if only $48. Oh, 45. Oh, fuck. It'd be one, it'd be 12, one, two. It's hung upside down. Two's here. If the word quan, <laughs> I actually know what the hitting the quan means. Hey man, you're using your right hand to touch your left ear. Nine chickens, two dogs, and three cats have a total of 40 legs. If a thumb is a finger, so you don't say, oh, thumbs aren't fingers, fuck you. Uh, hand finger, hand finger, hand finger, finger guns, hand finger, hand finger. Uh, unreal, real, street, sidewalk? Bam, 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 square is just bam, 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 bam. Pythagorean theorem, that's 10 centimeters, 10 centimeters, so that means that's gotta be 10 squared plus a squared plus b, so that's 10 centimeters as well, so then. Okay, I just remembered that if you score an IQ below like, 70, I'm pretty sure you're mentally, you're mentally ill. Not mentally ill, mentally challenged. I just realized I used the wrong terminology earlier. You complete your profile, has been generated, can be accessed immediately for 14.95. Fuck, I knew I was gonna have to spend money. Okay, so when shooting this video, I figured it was gonna make me spend money somehow. I really didn't wanna spend money for the IQ test. It's such a fucking scam though, that's the thing. The real smartest guy, if you guys wanna know who has the highest IQ, was the guy who decided to make IQ tests cost money. Okay, hey guys, quick cutaway. Well, off camera, after I put all my recording equipment away, I decided to look into it a little bit more to see if there is a way I can get IQ. You can request it and they'll email it to you without having to pay any of the money. It says my IQ is 132. Again, I don't know how accurate this is. It's not like an official test. Um, like this one said 132. The other one I took said like 148 or something like that. I don't know. Those seem kind of high. So then again, like I said, it may just be making it higher than it actually is to make you want to buy the IQ test. I don't know. I thought it'd be kind of fun then because there's like classifications that people put out. So here's one that Stanford put up for what IQ means about you. So you can see 40 to 54 is moderately impaired or delayed. This one, mildly impaired or delayed. Uh, 70 to 79, uh, borderline impaired or delayed. Uh, okay, so now you got 80 to 89, low average. These are probably the people who, you know, went to school, went to high school and they did all right and got okay grades, but they probably believe in conspiracy theories like, you know, microchips in my arm from the COVID vaccine and that 5G is scrambling your brain. Then you have 90 to 109. Those are average people, you know, Average people make the world go round. They're the ones in the uh, in the workforce, you know, doing all the grunt work that nobody else wants to do. High average, these are probably like your, you know, your managers at work, this and that. You know what I'm talking about. Superior, um, so you're pretty smart and you're just a little bit better than most people. Uh, then you can see you have 130 to 140. It's gifted or very advanced, which is actually the category I landed on. Uh, Dear Sex Savior, your free IQ score is 132. Like I said, it's probably fake. I don't know how accurate that is. It's not an official test, but based on that test, it thinks I'm gifted or very advanced, which is, I mean, I'll take it. So sounds like I am the smart guy. 12 people who have the highest IQ in the world. Stephen Hawkins, and while he's dead. 160, holy shit. That's crazy. That is 20 more than the, the very gifted or advanced. That is, let me see, I'm at 132. God damn, if I was smarter, I'd be able to tell how many points higher he was than me. Uh, 160 to 190. Okay, so this one they just said was a myth. Nobody actually knows. Kim Jong Un scored a 210. Good for him. No wonder he's ruling Korea. Uh, 225. Who the hell is this lady? Probably, probably works for like Microsoft or 
apple or something. Oh, no, he's just a cosmetologist. Okay, so he just does people's hair. Air, okay. I can't tell if I'm really attracted to the lady or really scared of her. 250 to 300, probably. Okay. This is what I imagine somebody with 268 IQ looks like. He just plays a little violin. 400, what the hell? That's, that's gotta be fake. Okay, I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. I think this article's fake. A 400 IQ? Yeah, that's a real thing. Anyways, back to the main video. I'm a little pissed about that. Uh, but like I said a couple minutes ago, I did expect this was gonna happen because most tests I, you take, free tests, but the results cost money. Luckily though, I actually had a plan B and that plan B is called Big Brain Academy. Brain versus brain. So here's the thing. I didn't want to pay money to see how smart I was. So I went on a Nintendo eShop and I paid $30 for the Big Brain <laughs> Academy. I see it's a little ironic. But hey, if I'm going to spend money to take an IQ test, I might as well spend it on Nintendo because at least it's fun. <laughs> Don't call me a nerd, but I can already feel some delay on this game. If I remember, a lot of it's timed. So here's the game plan. I'm actually going to use a GameCube controller. Never mind, this is dead. So what I'm going to use is actually the Joy-Cons. Hi, hello there. How are you doing? I didn't say that at all. I'm the headmaster of this academy. You can call me Dr. Lube. Okay. Next up, your catchphrase. You can change this later, so just pick anything that strikes your fancy now. I'll do it tomorrow. I'm not even gonna read the rest. I'll, I'll fix it later. Oh, shit, I can make a little human in the corner. Cool, I made Hame Hakas Jr. Practice. We talking about practice? Whack the moles with these. Okay. I feel like this is more reaction. Oh, shit. This is more reaction time than it is, uh... Oh, shit! Fuck. Okay, that was fucking terrible. I, I was, because I was talking through it, I think I just need to get focused. Big brain, 456. That was your activity your first time doing this practice activity. What do you think? I think I did terrible. I'm not gonna practice. I'm just gonna go straight into the test because I think my brain's already been warmed up from the scam IQ test I took. Let's measure your big brain brawn by having you complete activities in five categories. Identify, shit. This game again. I suck at this game. Jesus, I, okay. Memorize, okay, I don't know how good I am at memorizing. Memorize these cards and answer. What is going on? Am I doing something wrong? Pineapple cupcakes. Pineapple. Shit. That one was a lot harder, actually, on my fellow. Uh, rotate the hands to match the time. Set the time to nine. Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh, there we go. I have to turn it. Okay, I got it. What? Set the time to 11. Spring forward one hour, so I want to go to 12. Holy shit, these controls suck ass. Fall back one hour, so I got to go to nine. Fall back three hours, so I want to go to... 12? Shit. Oh shit, these controls suck ass. I knew I should've got the fucking GameCube controller. Oh shit, I started on nine. Fall back 210. Oh shit. That was so hard with the control. That was, I'm not even gonna lie, that one was tough as fuck. Analyze, count the number of cubes, try to find the best counting method. Three. Uh, five. Uh, four. Three, five, six. So, oh shit, do I have to count the ones that are hidden too? Um, so that'd be three, that'd be five. Oh, there's ones in the back, I think. Okay, okay, I see, so that'd be three, six, seven. Uh, one, that'd be... Fuck. Visualize. Add missing train tracks to get the train to where it needs to go. Okay, easy enough. Fuck. Shit, I'm getting my shit rocked right now. You need it to go this way. Oh, shit, right when I was starting to get it, them fuckers got scared and ended the clock. How was your first test? The higher your score, the more impressive your performance. My big brain brawn score is around 3,300. An average person who hasn't spent time in practice will score around 1,500. Without further ado, let's take a look at the test results. So 1,500's average is what I was hearing. Okay, so I'm average. Okay, I'm a little above average. Okay, I'm not quite, I'm not quite Mr. Lube. Now then, it's time to give your brain grade. Oh! Let's go! But you're just getting started. Let's aim for higher heights together. That, what the fuck? I'm just getting started. I got an A plus, brother. What's higher than A plus? 
Now it's time to announce your brain type, which is based on your big brawn brain score. This is your brain type at this time. I'm really good at identifying things, I guess. Um, they should hire me to be the guy who stands in front of the people, five people lined up, and I go, number three, he was number three, he did the crime. They should hire me to do that. This game is pretty fun, and I'll play it more later, but I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. I actually had a plan C in case this game didn't give me enough information to still prove I was smart. So my plan C is gonna be the human benchmarking test. If you've watched any YouTuber, then you've probably seen somebody try this before. So this is the last chance I have to prove that I am smart. So the first one's reaction time. Shit, there was a stupid ad and distracted me. Okay, that was slow as fuck. I'm so bad, 204. That's average, dude. All right, second is sequence memory. Okay, I get it, Simon says. Oh shit, level nine is bad. No, it's average. Oh fuck, that's not good. I was supposed to prove that was smart, not average. Oh, fuck. All right, what about the number memory? Eight. Eight. 805, that's one, that's easy to remember because that's my favorite type of beer to drink. 80, 91, 30, zero. 31, fuck, I suck, dude. Um, okay, verbal memory. You will be shown words one at a time. If you've seen a word during the test, click seen. If it's a new word, click new. New, seen, seen, new, new, seen, new. Cause it has ass in it, I would remember that. Seen, 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 new, seen. Fuck! The chimp test. Oh, that's perfect. I've always wanted the monkey. One, two, three, four, easy. Continue. One, two, three, four, five, got it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Got it. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Continue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Continue. Five, seven. One, two, three, four. I already forgot where five was. Five, nope. 11. That's average two. Ha! Ah. Okay, visual memory, got it. Okay. Fuck, I forgot that one. 12. Average again, oh! <sighs> so I guess after everything, um, I've learned that I'm not the smart guy. Uh, because all I did was get scammed on an IQ test, got a low score on a baby game, and got mad about the controls, and then did completely average on every single test on the human benchmark. So, if I'm not the smart guy, I'll keep looking to see what kind of guy I am actually. Maybe I'm just the sad, lonely guy. Anyway, thanks for watching.